In this video, I'll be showing how to get Mixamo animations to MetaHumans in Unreal Engine 5. First of all, you'll need to download Mixamo Converter and unzip it to your hard drive. In one of the folders is the mannequin, which we'll be importing to Mixamo. So open up the Mixamo Converter, go to Upload and click on the Mixamo button. This will take you to the Mixmo page, and if you haven't used it before, you'll need to sign up. This is the default character. I just set it back for this tutorial, but once you've changed it once, you won't need to change it again for future. Drag the mannequin from the Mixmo Converter folder in and upload. Next, search for an animation. Click download and pick your settings. I'm using these for now. Open the folder where it is being downloaded and copy paste or drag this into the incoming Mixmo Converter folder. Go back to the Mixmo Converter, go to Convert and click the Convert button. Now copy paste or drag that file to a folder on your hard drive where you want to keep your animations. Next, in Unreal we need to have the Mannequin Assets, if you don't already. Right click in your Content folder in Unreal and choose Third Person and Add to Project. Now, drag that UE4 animation file from your Hard Drive Animation folder into Unreal. For Skeleton, choose this one, SK Mannequin Skeleton. Next, search for RTG and open up this one, UE4 to UE5. When it first comes up, it will show the UE4 mannequin and the UE5 mannequin, and how the animation plays for both. To get it working with MetaHuman, we need to find out the body type for the MetaHuman we want to use. In this case, it's female, tall, narrow. Search for that in Target Preview Mesh to change it. And now we can see how the animation works for that metahuman body type. Now click export selected animation. Choose which folder you want it to go to. And we now have that metahuman animation saved. In level sequence, if you drag your metahuman in, delete the control rig, and if you search in animations, there it is, ready to use. And that's it. If you have any questions, drop a comment below, and thanks for watching.